We present a first method for analyzing growing plants from 4D point cloud recording the growth and decay of a plant. Here we see the Anthodium growth time lapse video and point cloud over four weeks, captured by our custom-made acquisition devices. This is different than previous methods for geometry reconstruction of 4D point cloud, where the underlying objects are assumed to be incompressible, that is to say, the objects can deform but not grow or decay. Tracking plant growth and detecting structural growth events require fundamentally different data analysis algorithms. In contrast to previous approaches for analyzing plant growth, our method can faithfully track the shape dynamics and reveal the underlying growth components and detect temporal events. Our acquisition is based on structured light technology that consists of a camera projector pair and a turning table on which the plant is set. The structured light scanner captures the geometry of the plant from a specific view. The turntable rotates for 30 degrees each time and pauses for scanning. So a full cycle scan is made of 12 single view scans that are registered together to make one frame of the 4D point cloud. We take a bi-directional approach. Step forward through all the frames, detecting strong evidences that an event has occurred in the past, and then step backward to correctly locate the traces of the spatiotemporal event. We now show some results. Our method can faithfully detect the budding and decaying of the plant's leaves. We can also detect the bifurcation of plant stems. Here we show a dancing bean and the event detection. Due to the delicate stem structure of the plant, it demonstrates significant body movement during its growth. Yet our method is still able to track and detect the critical event movements. We demonstrate two computer graphics applications with the output of our algorithm. Here we show an application of plant dynamics simulation based on a static plant model captured in our experiment. The simulation results can be improved from our robust leaf segmentation. To the left, unresolved leaf overlap results in two leaves glued together in the simulation. Additionally, such overlap creates a loop structure that the simulator cannot handle, resulting in two leaves breaking off from one of the stems. On the contrary, cross-frame organ information transfer provides correct information for realistic simulation to the right side. Continuing with the previous application, extracted organ properties can be further fed as simulation parameters. Here we show effects of stiffness parameter. In the left simulation, the stiffness value is set to be constant. In the middle simulation, stiffness is set to be inversely proportional to the stem age, as analyzed by our algorithm. For this plant, the middle tall stem is the younger one, thus is the least stiff. In the right simulation, the stiffness values are further modulated to enhance visual effects a little more. Manually creating dynamic plants with both growth and motion is very tedious work for artists. Here we demonstrate another application where a digital plant model is brought to life by, or synthesized from, a real growth sequence, encoding organs extracted and tracked by our algorithm. Distinctive colors indicate corresponding organs. Thank you.